Well, welcome again. My name is Pastor Denunga Sonne Joseph of Success Dimension Church, Ibadan, Nigeria. This is the part two of the topic, Get Over It. In part one, I was trying to let you know that it is very important for you to know. Knowledge of what you have gives you power. Knowledge is equal to power. When you know something and you apply what you know, then you become a master of that thing. If you do not know something, you become ignorant. Then you become weak. That, be that thing becomes your master. For instance, if you have a piano and you cannot play the piano, then the piano happens to be your master. If you have a car and you cannot drive, you don't know how to drive, then you'll be a slave of driving. Though that car is yours, yet it will be your master. You may have a driver who drives you, but as far as driving is concerned, you are ignorant. So knowledge is very important in this world. And that is why I want you to know some things so that you can get over any problem that is facing you in life. There are seven things I want you to get to know so that you can get over any problem in this world. Number one, never blame anybody for what happens. Whatever happens in your life, blame yourself. Not your friend, not your father, not your mother, not your pastor, not the president of your country, not the governor of your state. Blame yourself. When you develop the attitude of blaming others, you will not quickly understand the reason why you failed. Because instead of you facing the problem and looking for the way out, you'll be shifting the problem on other people and you will not be able to find a solution to your problem. So you will not be able to get over it. Praise God. Number two, you have to take quick and decisive action. It is very, very important to get over your problem. You need quick decision and you need to take your decision fast. And not only that, you need to go all out to execute the decision which you have made. The third thing is that you have to be single focused. You cannot do everything at the same time. The best way to get out of your problem or present situation is to have a goal, be focused. The Bible says Jesus was quoting Jesus. He says, if your eyes be, be single, then your whole body will be full of light. If you are focused, if you are directed, if you know where you are going, you will go straight there. There is no wasting of time. No, no beating about the bush. You must have a focus. And you must focus on your goal and it will help you it will not help you as you look at these things another thing is that it is very very important to develop yourself you cannot just sit in one spot and believe for the best you have to go for the best by training yourself lack of adequate training has brought about failure to so many people you have to train yourself attend seminars Retrain yourself, um, attend workshops, read books, go over, go into the internet, seek for information, look for new friends, meet new friends, share with them, learn from your friends. These are ways you can get over your problem. It's not good, there's no point in sitting alone and bemoaning over your loss. Socialize, get to know people, sample people's opinions. Help, get help from those you need help from. And that takes me to the next one. If you need help, ask for it. There's nothing bad in asking people to help you. You cannot get over it until you learn to ask for people's help. There is nobody on earth that does not need help. Everyone that is upon the face of the earth needs somebody's help. The president of your country didn't get there without help. Every great man in this world got there by seeking and soliciting for the help of other people. You need the help of other people. Go for help. Ask for help. Don't be shy of asking people to help you. It is very, very important. Then the next one is that don't be afraid of making mistakes. Mistakes abound. If you don't make mistakes, you, you cannot get it. You cannot make it. You cannot succeed. There is no success without failure. Success is inside failure. It is from failure that you get success. May the Lord bless you. Don't forget, 
get all right whatever you are going through for more encouragement visit motivationfortoday.com or sourcesgalore.blogspot.com or write me or email me at sourcesdimensionchurch at gmail.com god bless you amen